us talk today about the ever bustling city of Mumbai, the city which is said to never sleep. Now this is the map of our country and you can see that this is Maharashtra. Mumbai is situated in the state of Maharashtra. It is actually the capital of this state. It was earlier known as Bombay. It is called the financial capital of India. Now Mumbai, since it is located on the western coast of India, it faces the Arabian Sea. The climate of Mumbai is neither too hot nor too cold. It is humid during summers and monsoons. It receives very heavy rainfall in the months of June, July and August. Winters are pleasant in this city. Now let us quickly do this. Mumbai is also known as the city of joy, the financial capital of India, the pink city. What do you think is the correct answer? Of course, it is also known as the financial capital of India. Now the governor, the chief minister and other state government ministers of Maharashtra live in Mumbai. The offices of the Maharashtra state government are located here. What are the famous places that you must remember to visit in Mumbai? The Gateway of India. It is an arched historical monument built by the British. Nariman Point. Now Nariman Point is the premier business district of Mumbai. It boasts of various skyscrapers. Bandra Verli Ceiling. Now this is a cable bridge which connects the northern and western part of Mumbai. Marine Drive. It is a beautiful walkway where a lot of people come every day to see the beautiful sea. Tara Porbala Aquarium. Now this aquarium boasts of a wide variety of marine life. Be sure to visit this if you are in this city. Malabar Hills is a premier residential area of Mumbai. It is extremely beautiful. Jahangir Art Gallery. This is a very famous art gallery in Mumbai. Essel World. You children will surely know Essel World because it is one of the largest amusement parks in our country. The Prince of Wales Museum. Now this is a heritage site and hosts a lot of artifacts. The Vankhede Stadium, you all must be knowing that various cricket matches are held here. The Shoe House in the Kamla Nehru Park, this is the oldest children's park in Mumbai. Hanging Gardens are terrace gardens perched on the top of Malabar Hills. The Elephanta Caves is a major tourist attraction here. These are located near Mumbai and are famous for beautiful stone carvings. The fort area of Mumbai is the commercial and cultural center. It is located near the Mumbai port and gets its name from the defensive fort, Fort George. What are the various beaches of Mumbai? Juhu Beach, Varsova Beach, Aksa Beach and Girgom Chaupati are some of the famous beaches that you must remember to visit. The famous religious places of Mumbai are the Haji Ali Darga, Sri Siddhi Vinayak Mandir and the Basilica of Our Lady of the Mount. So Mumbai has famous research centers, the Bhaba Atomic Research Center and the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research are the two very important research centers here. The Bhaba Atomic Research Center carries out research related to the peaceful use of atomic energy and the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research is dedicated to basic research in mathematics and science. 
Now, Mumbai is the financial capital of India and boasts of many industries like the cotton textile industry, medicines, electronic goods, and edible oil. Now, Bombay High is a very, very important part of the industrial sector of Mumbai. It is situated on the Arabian Sea and is one of the most important petroleum fields in India. So Bombay High is actually a petroleum field in the Arabian Sea. Crude oil is taken out from here and refined to be used in vehicle and making other petroleum products. You all must be knowing that Mumbai is very famous for its film industry. Mumbai is famous for producing films. The film center of Mumbai is called Bollywood. And the film city is a famous film studio in Mumbai. I'm sure you all have already heard of the film city. Now various modes of transport are used by the people staying in Mumbai. They use the metro rail, the monorail, the local trains are a very, very important part of transport for the people staying here. Buses, taxis, and auto rickshaws are also there. Now this is the most important railway station of Mumbai. It was earlier known as the Victoria Terminus. Nowadays, it is called the Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj Terminus. It is a very important railway station and is located near the fort area. Sahar International Airport or the Chhatrapati Shivaji International Airport is one of the busiest airports in our country. Now, Mumbai boasts of two ports. The Mumbai port is the largest port in India. The Jawaharlal Nehru port is also a very important port of Mumbai. Now, which language is spoken in Mumbai? People mostly speak Marathi here. Other languages like English, Hindi are also spoken, but this is the main language here. What are the festivals of Mumbai? The Ganesh Chaturthi is the most famous and important festival of Mumbai. What kind of food are you likely to find here? Vada Pao, Pao Bhaji, Bhel Puri, Shrikant are available in almost every corner of the city. Let us look at a few important personalities who have hailed from Mumbai. Bal Gangadhar Tilak, who was a nationalist and a teacher. Dada Saheb Falke, who is the father of our Indian cinema. Homi J. Bhabha, a very noted physicist. Salman Rushdie, a very famous writer. Sachin Tendulkar, our favorite cricketer, are all from Mumbai. Now let us quickly do this. Which of the following places is located in Mumbai? Marine Drive, Victoria Memorial, Red Fort. Now do you think either Victoria Memorial or the Red Fort is situated in Mumbai? No. Marine Drive is situated in Mumbai. So today, we have learned some interesting facts about Mumbai. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the Delta Step app to get all learning resources as per ICSC, CBSC, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. Over 5,000 amazing lectures across maths, science, English and social science. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace 
with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests, performance analysis with actionable feedback, personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You can also win amazing prizes like PlayStation, iPad, watches, and many more along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So learning at Delta Step is not just fun and easy, it is also rewarding. So register for free now.